going to show you how to do a back carry called the double hammock with a woven wrap. So what you want to do is you want to start off and you want to find your middle marker. Your middle marker is going to end up in the middle of your chest. So what you want to do is reach around and give enough extra space about how much you would need for your baby and put it in the middle of your back. It's usually about an arm's length away from the middle marker. So this is now your new middle marker. This is where you line up in the back of the, in the middle of the baby's back. So from here, you get your baby. Get some cookies. Tea. <laughs> you get the baby on your back. So from here, you get everything spread. And just to make sure that your middle marker is still double check to make sure that it's lined up to where it's going to be in the middle. Because if it's too far off center, then your tails won't be long enough. So, what you want to do is create a pocket and make sure that pocket is nice and deep. That's the key to keeping the baby from sliding off your back. So, what you want to do is you have a long side and a short side. Your long side goes under your arm and the short side goes over your shoulder. So from here, just make sure it's nice and tight and tuck this path between your knees. From here, this is going to be the path that goes across your chest. So pull it nice and tight. Go underneath this path that you have tucked between your legs. Make The key is making sure that it stays nice and tight. From here, make sure you still have your pocket. You want to grab your top rail with the opposite hand and flip it up over the back. And pull as you go to make sure that it's tight. You don't have to create another pocket, but with the second pass, I like to tuck the second pass to make an extra pocket. And this goes up and over your shoulder. So from here, make sure it's still nice and tight. You can stand up from here. What you want to do is make sure that it's still nice and tight with the pockets. From here, just pull it nice and tight. You can stand up. What you want to do is go over the baby's leg, under the leg, and then tie in the front. And this is still a little bit loose, so now that I've figured out that it's loose, what you want to do is trace it along and just pull. And that feels much more secure now. So, as I said, over the legs, under the legs to make that X, and then stand up and tie in the front. And that is how you do a double hammock in a woven